Well, so the main challenges that we see in the market are, yeah, first of all, data fragmentation. So data fragmentation means every, every customer, every client, every company has lots of data sources and uh, data, and the data, it's not only yeah, kept in, uh, in, in, the, in the different channels, no, it's also teams and technologies that are fragmented and therefore we see that as a, as, a, as a huge challenge. The second challenge that we also see is that the, the ecosystem in the digital marketing gets bigger and bigger. We have lots of technologies and those te technologies uh, are always delivering good experiences. But the problem is that they are not really communicating with each other. So therefore, it's not only the data fragmentation, but also the technologies that are behind are fragmented. And uh, the last, uh, the last uh, challenge that we see, of course there are many others, but where we think this, uh, it's an important one, is that the data that it's collected, companies are really struggling to activate that data in the right, uh, in the right moment. When a customer, a client is on site or it's in the, in the shop uh, and is handling kind of uh, interactions and uh, finding the really the right moment of truth, it's really, really a hard topic and uh, we are really happy to, to solve that problem. So the, the reason why companies need to invest in customer data platforms, it's not just in customer data platforms. The companies, they need to invest in a whole end-to-end -end strategy. That means that the customer data platform sits in the middle of, of, the, of the data, of the customer journey, of the experiences. But you need also take care to, to collect the right data and therefore you need a solid data foundation. Then you need the CDP to enrich profiles, get customer insights and then you need the part where you activate the data. So it's not just a CDP, it's an end-to-end -end solution that needs to be implemented. Nevertheless, I think a customer data platform, it's based on first-party data, and everyone knows that first-party data, nowadays is, it's the goal, and uh, you need to take care about your first-party data and also govern the data with privacy rules and regulation and therefore I think the end-to-end -end solution is really important. Again here, just to, 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 to pick up my last answer, Telium offers different kind of modules. So we call it the Universal Data Hub. It's not just a customer data platform. And the Universal Data Hub starts, as I said, with the data collection. And we are able to collect data client-side and server-side. That means we are handling the yeah, data foundation part. This is one module that we have. Then we have the customer data platform that it's called audience stream in our, in our language. And audience stream is where we create profiles, where we enrich profiles, where we do segmentation, but also where we handle the governance of, of the, the regulations. And then we have a part that it's called data access and data access helps you to get access to the data that you have enriched from all your digital and non-digital uh, assets and I think this is this is what Telium can really offer and uh, and as said so really starting from the data collection till the data activation is really important for us and this is where we can help. So mobile first, mobile is it's a really important source nevertheless Telium has already invested since 2009 in mobile so we see the mobile data as a data source and as being the, 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 the solution that collects the data, mobile data is also important for us. But as said, we have a huge community in, uh, from mobile developers that are already using our integrations with SDKs, with mobile web, and therefore we see the challenge of mobile first as a, a normal data source. So we leverage the data from mobiles and we are really happy to uh, put that in a common view of the customer. So mobile first, it's as said, a data source just for us. So the Mexico, it's, uh, it's every year, it's, uh, it's nice to meet uh, clients, prospects, but also lots of partners and colleagues. So it's a get together 
share the knowledge and share the new technology trends. So I'm really happy and always excited to be at the Mexico.